First, we have image classification. Image classification allows us to assign an image to two or more labeled categories. Essentially, it answers the question, what is contained in this image? For example, we can use image classification to tag the content contained in an image. We provide the model with an image as input, then the model produces a category label and a confidence score as output. Image classification is useful anytime you're trying to assign a categorical label or multiple tags to a collection of images. For example, auto-tagging images on social media posts, detecting product defects via visual inspection, or diagnosing medical issues like detecting certain types of skin cancer. Second, we have object detection. Object detection allows us to identify the locations of various objects in an image. Essentially, it answers the question, where are the objects located in this image? For example, we can use object detection to identify various items contained in an image. We provide the model with an image as input, then the model produces the coordinates of a bounding box for each object in the image as output. Object detection is useful anytime you have images with multiple objects that need to be located. For example, counting the number of objects in a photo, detecting people in surveillance videos, or detecting various obstacles in self-driving cars. Third, we have face recognition. Face recognition allows us to identify a person contained in an image by their facial features. Essentially, it answers the question, who's in this image? For example, we can use face recognition to determine who is contained in our photos. We provide the model with an image as input, then the model produces the identity of the person contained in the image and a confidence score as output. Face recognition is useful anytime you need to identify people in images. For example, identifying customers as they enter your store, identifying the occupants of your office building, and tagging your friends in photos on social media. To learn more, please click the link in the description. For more content like this, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe.